All right, I'm at work, as we all know. Um, vegan mukbang. This is corn taco, vegan cheese, onions, garlic, mushroom, green beans, carrots, and squash. Um, there's no dairy products. There's no um, animals, butters, nothing. It's all plant-based. And oh, there's also a little bit of corn in there for just a little sweet taste. But um, like, mm. when have you ever seen carrots on a taco? Never. But it's delicious. Who am I going to talk about today? Um, let's talk about weight loss and how I'm literally only about four pounds away from being 299, which is my goal by December. I'm just shocked at how I've adjusted to the 16 hour fast again that's eating no later than 6 p.m. and no earlier than 10 p.m. 10 a.m. and in between the times when I'm eating I eat this meal at 10 and I eat a smaller light protein filled like beans or something dinner Maybe five, and then that's it. I only drink zero calorie beverages, water. Um, nothing with artificial sweeteners too much. Um, lemon and ginger water is good. But for me, it's all about the food. It's all about being satisfied with what's on the plate. And that's the why taco too. Like. You don't need meat. I think if people get over trying to be rebellious, they'd realize that you can eat without really harming your system. And you'll feel so much better. People eat meat just because nobody's going to tell them they, not, they can't have meat. Instead of realizing that, a plant-based diet is in punishment. Chow, vegan cheese. It, it 
tastes better than any ch cheddar cheese I've ever had in my life. And it's made from cashews and some other strange things. But <laughs> the fact that I can eat something that tastes like cheese and give me the same mouthfeel and satisfaction as cheese without having the severe diarrhea and body bloat that, you know, regular cheese gave me is like godsend. So, my nephew, who um, I take care of, recently had a birthday, and I struggled with what to tell a ten-year-old. He had a little lighthearted conversation, but um, it's like, what do you tell a ten-year-old? Like, what what does that milestone means, and what should be said? Because. <clears throat> I grew up with nobody telling me anything. And I think I turned out fairly okay. Um, but I also know I'm special. And um, children these days need all the um, support and guidance that they can get because the world is vicious. Um, so. I, I, I jokingly made a video about our conversation, but I know now that I have to open up to him more and have conversations about life and finance and relationship um, and spirituality and all of that good stuff because, you know, if it's never talked about, then you can never assume that a person knows. And as the parent, guardian, adult, in a child's life, we have the responsibility to demonstrate or be an example of what we would like to see out of them. You can't just be preaching about being a good person and you're an asshole. Because they're hearing you, but they're seeing an asshole. And what are they going to be when they grow up? An asshole. Hopefully not. But kids learn from what they see, not from what they hear. You know, so. Um, my grandma, well, his grandmother didn't get him something. And he said, um, no, the love you show me is enough. I'm happy. I could have bawled crying because what 10-year-old you know? Is that grateful? Who gets it? You know, it's almost as if he was reading a script or something. I just could not believe that he was able to be that profoundly grateful. You know, and he doesn't have to be. We make excuses for a 10 year old. If he had said no, with him, we would have been like, oh, you know, it's typical. But because he was so profoundly grateful, I was just take, taking. I just couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't believe it, but I was, I was, I was impressed and, um, and I knew why I knew we, we really do set a good example around him and he, he is picking it up and he's becoming a young man and it's a beautiful sight, you know, um, it's just, it's an amazing experience to be around a growing child and watch them develop into the person that they're going to be.
don't know if you haven't noticed or not, I love a taco. <laughs> that was TC. Um, peace and blessings. Enjoy the rest of your day.